new frontiers are coming. Electric airplanes, hypersonic flight, commercial human space exploration. As aerospace engineer at Texas A&M, we pursue these new frontiers. Engineering sometimes can sound like this very dry, certainly technical, soulless subject. But engineering is about creativity. It's about taking people with a very specific set of talents and turning that creativity knob up and going out and being successful with that. This is an incredibly well-resourced university. We can give them space. We can give them interesting capabilities like a wind tunnel in the building. But then they can go around the college, even off campus if they need to, um, to Easterwood, to the facilities we have there, new laser diagnostics. It's just, it's so diverse. And I, I believe it's built around the right needs and the right capabilities. Our undergraduate and graduate programs are consistently ranked in the top 10. We do research in a variety of areas, spanning from autonomous intelligence systems to reacting flows. Space exploration and hypersonics have especially experienced unprecedented growth. Over the history of Texas A&M, we've maintained close collaborations with the NASA Johnson Space Center program. We've got some graduates that, from our program that uh, have made important impacts there. One of the things that's unique about our facilities at Texas A&M is they're developed and built by our students, and our students have created a laboratory that really is one of the most capable laboratories in the United States in terms of hypersonics. We have some really great people in our department who are leaders in their respective areas. Some of them are actually NA members. We have some great facilities in the department. We have excellent staff. And last but not the least, we have an incredible cater of undergraduate and graduate students. NASA Johnson Space Center is in our backyard. The Department of Defense trusts us with their most pressing issues and our former students work for the most well-known aerospace companies. These planes are not accidents. They're just one unique part of the Agile network, which reflects the quality of our education and research. You don't go to grad school to stay at the status quo. You go to push that envelope. And so I think the sort of culture of excellence, uh, the resources we have available, and that drive that's present all around us is a fantastic reason to come to A&M for graduate education. There's so many awesome research opportunities at A&M, especially in the past few years. The diversity of research has really, like, I feel like, exponentially grown. Their education here, like, it really challenges you to think out outside of the box. It prepares you to face a problem and think around it and come up with a creative solution. We collaborate a lot with other schools and other departments, including the medical department, the kinesiology department. We have a lot of collaborations going on in the Houston area with other industry and, and companies out there. So this makes Texas A&M as a unique environment to really thrive and investigate all these research questions. Our faculty passionately develop and prepare leaders with curriculum relevant to today's and tomorrow's aerospace needs. But it's about more than just success. It is about doing it together, experiencing Aggie traditions, enjoying our research, and making a better world. I really like the student body here. I think like the Aggie family is real, the Aggie network, the Aggie family is real. Once you become an Aggie, you're always an Aggie. Like if you see someone walking around with the Aggie ring, you're gonna stop them and you know talk to them. We are a community of dreamers, tight-knit and loyal as it is the Aggie way. Our working, curious, and passionate students are welcome here. Join us. What difference will you make?